Hey guys, this is Chris, and I'm going to show you real quick how to do the stick calibration on the Xeno controller. Hubson makes it a little difficult. You need about three hands to do it, but we'll try her out. <laughs> so we're going to hold the left, the right and left stick up in the upper left hand corners, and then you're going to hold down the power button. Lights are on, and now we got the flash. That's what you want to hear. You want to hear that flash. All you're trying to do here is hit all the axis points. Left, right, left, right, left, right, up, down, up, down, up, down. Full motion circles. Don't rush it. Full motion circles. It doesn't matter how you do it. As long as you go full circles, you can go left and right, you can go up and down. The key here is hitting all the access points. So now you can hit this button or this button and you're done. So now it's done. So all we did there, in case you couldn't hear me through the, bear, the beeping, is you're calibrating it by hitting full access points, whether that be left and right, up and down, or full circles. You can do it by going full circles only, but just like the other Hubson transmitters, I always go left, right, left, right. I don't rush it, take my time, hit the full point, and then do my circles. Doesn't matter if you do them in opposite direction, same direction, whatever, as long as you hit the full axis points. So that's how you calibrate the Hubson transmitter. This is a good thing to do, just like your other calibrations with the drone. Do your calibration with your transmitter. Thanks and have a great day.